but I do want to start building up like that core audience and really just kind of like bring that unity so that whenever it is time to really like blow up, I can really have like that infrastructure of in that core, you know, following and that, that community. And I, I, and like, I'm more big on the impact also, which is why, like, I don't really like to do things that are kind of like, I guess, I guess pointless. So yeah, I, I'm going a little bit off. Oh, no, this is a podcast. Yeah. <laughs> this, is what's, this is what this is for. <laughs> yeah, to, to answer your question, that's, that's what uh, let me leave. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, hey, don't be afraid to go on tangents. That's that's what podcasts are for. The people are here to, to hear your story. Um, I got you. <laughs> <laughs> let's get started. You mentioned that you started recording songs in your room on SoundCloud. When people ask, like, how you get started, how did you get started with music? What origin story do you tell them? Man, it, it goes back, like, because because music has always been, like, kind of like the soundtrack to my life. So, mm. you know, for me, like, I just love, I just love making music. I, I've been obsessed with, you know what I mean, making music since I was, you know, like, 12. But I, even then, I could think back, you know what I mean, when I was in, like, third grade, uh, there was these two girls who would, who wanted to sing. And I was kind of, like, shy. So I would just like write them songs, like, and then make them sing them, and then we would film like little like music videos. Like we were like kids though, um, you know. And then my mom had like a laptop whenever I was a kid, like five years old, four years old, and I used to just get on there and just like you know what I mean, try to make like little songs. Or I'd go, I would go outside and I'd sit on the porch and I'd just like try to like come up with some melodies, you know, at the time. And it was just like you know, kid doing kid things. Uh, and then I got into content creation for a little bit. Uh, I really liked like Phase Clan and like Call of Duty streamers. So I used to just like try to hit like uh, like clips. Um, but that led me to doing like reaction videos to at the time Musically was a thing, and I was in like seventh grade, so Musically was a thing, and so I started making like reaction videos to kids at my school's Musicallys, and they were always like super bad, uh, and so. Um, my teacher played one of my videos in class and like everybody thought it was like hilarious, but then I got into beef with this, uh, with this kid. And so I wrote like a diss track for the YouTube channel. And that was, that was like the first rap I ever like wrote. And it was really, really like bad. And like, <laughs> I had deleted it. Uh, and then, um, you know, I, I started to really get into like, I want to say like Kendrick Lamar to pimp a butterfly uh, and like Eminem. Like, I, like at first I really started with like the lyrical rap, like, like the new, the new age lyrical rap. I wasn't really well versed on like the old school stuff. So I like Kendrick. I liked, you know what I mean? J Cole, Eminem, like at the time it was like, I want to say like 2017, 2018. Mm. And I was like, I was in like eighth grade. Um, so I started, I, yeah <laughs> you was in eighth grade in 2017 2018 i think so i think i think so ah, at the top man. of my head yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm only 20 i was born in 2003 <laughs> Ooh, we might have to end the podcast i graduated yeah. college in 2017 jesus <laughs> yeah yeah so 